Sadiq Khan sparked a new war of words between cabbies and Uber today with a series of new measures to help black cab drivers. The mayor's introducing new ranks, opening up more bus lanes and providing financial support. Uber says he's discriminating against its drivers. Luke Hanrahan has been hearing both sides of the row. The rise of Uber has put pressure on these. Today, the mayor announced his plans to protect cabbies, including a hundred more taxi ranks, a grant to help scrap the oldest and most polluting taxis, and student loans to pay for the knowledge. Uber says the mayor is discriminating against its drivers. We think that this is really disproportionate. It's going to impact ordinary private hire drivers in London working today. It's going to mean that it's harder to get into the industry and ultimately it could mean that some drivers lose their livelihoods. In terms of Uber, they've accused you of discriminating against them. What do you have to say to that? Well, I don't apologise for wanting to raise the standards across the board. Who could be against additional compliance officers to make sure there isn't illegal touting or criminality? Who could be against uh, all taxis and private vehicles being properly insured? And I'm not clear who is against uh, consumers being safe to use these private vehicles. So were taxi drivers overjoyed at the mayor's support? Many reacted like this. Yeah, I mean, this is a good announcement from the mayor. Um, it's too little and too late, but it's a good start. We particularly welcome, and all Londoners should welcome, his proposal to force minicab operators to insure their vehicles. There's a war of words between black cab drivers and Uber, and that war can be seen on the streets of London. The battle lines are here at places like St Pancras Station. You can see black cab drivers and Uber drivers competing for the passenger. I use Uber because it's cheaper. Um, I would like to use black taxis, but unfortunately for, I think, for people who are, uh, you know, working and not making a hell of a lot of money, they just can't afford to use black cabs. Uber. Why? Um, well, it's cheaper. In my experience, it's safer. I use both of them. It really depends. Uh, for business, usually it's uh, taxis and cabs. And for personal, sometimes it's Ubers. An ongoing conflict between two sets of drivers. Today's announcement only adding fuel to the fire. Luke Hanrahan, ITV News.